Now imagine you got a boy, you are sucked up with Sir Nicholas, and you have a <laughs> shit like the Bali, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, ready? Hi, welcome to Abode. Today we are bringing you a brand new series called Inside Out. Hi, my name is Stanley. My name is Tony. Today, we are going to talk about the latest new launch happening this weekend and its name is called MO Residence yeah, So MO Residence is located in the heart of Singapore specifically in the centre of Singapore if you look at the Google Maps and it is situated at Amokyo Avenue 1 which is at the end of Pishan Park 1 It is a 99 year lease, whole 25 storeys, 2 blocks and comprising of 372 luxurious units for you to look at now, so we all know that there's no new launch at all for the past eight years uh, except for Panorama which is uh, of quite close proximity Now if you are a nature lover and you are an outdoor person you're gonna love the place Do you know there are a few parks there for you to enjoy with your family? Yeah, uh, just in front of Emerald Resident there's a Bishan Amokyo Park which you basically you can walk there and enjoy your leisure time The other nearest one will be Lower Pierce Reservoir and the other two is Amokyo Town Garden East and Town Garden West How often that you have four parks within your uh, residence? Yeah, just to add on, you know that the Barichu Reservoir is only minutes drive away from Amo Residences Now, another good thing that we want to highlight is that not many developments that we know has got two great schools within a one kilometer proximity What are the schools? The schools are St. Nicholas, CHIJ Girl school and also I Tong Primary School. Now imagine you have a girl, you have CSIJ, and you have a boy, you go to I Tong. So apart from the great schools that you have at the Amo residences, the connectivity is super. Tony, Amo residence is walking distance five minutes to Mayflower MRT via exit six. The best part is at Mayflower MRT under Thompson East Coast Lines, there are four interchange which is cross island line downtown line circle line and northeast line <coughs> and if you're driving there's a north south corridor expected to be completed in 2027 this north south corridor is intersect with sle ecp and pie which is expected to save an average travel time between 10 to 15 minutes so so much time you can save but how about somewhere even nearer so for malls, you can go to Amokyo Hub. We all know that Amokyo Hub has got a plethora number of shops and eateries inside, even though a movie theatre. So if you find Amokyo Hub is a little bit too, too crowded, you can go to Thompson Plaza. Yes, Thompson Plaza, the car park is extremely crowded, but you are just minutes away, you can take the public transport down. And we all know that Thompson Plaza has got a lot of nice eateries, especially Japanese food. It's got a huge supermarket, and you can even have all your kids to go there for enrichment classes now if this two is still not enough take a short little transport you have Bishan Junction 8 another huge mall for you to enjoy now apart from having malls and aircon eateries well you still have your usual hawker food so there's plenty of hawker areas in Amokyo which is a mature estate you have the hawker centre at 628 Kabang Baru and you also have the Samal Hills and finally you also have my favorite Undongi chicken rice, oh, which yes. is 5 minute walking distance to Emerald Resident. So, with such amount of amenities, excellent connectivity, transport, you even have top schools that are so near to your place within 1 km. What do you think of Emerald Residence? I think the demand for Emerald Resident will be good since there's no new launch since 8 years ago. Well, Tony, you know what, what I think? Well, I think it's time for a boat 3-on-3 three three. Okay, what is, what is your 3-on-3? Three 3-on-3 three? Well, three three is basically uh, how we are going to evaluate um, how good and well the development is um, 3 good points uh, and 3 not so nice So, um, how about each one we give ourselves and point out what we think uh? Let me go first Okay, I think it's a good place because nature, I'm a nature lover So many parks, you can even go for hiking You've got nice sunset, you've got sunrise depending on which is the floor that you have Second one will be the top schools Boy or girl, I have choices to go to I can go to a girl's school or I can go to uh, Aitong which is a mixed school How about you, Tony? I think a more reason, one of the 
main things I like MO is that is it because it's a location. It's a it's just a five minutes walk to the MRT and uh, this uh, upper Thompson East Coast Line is connected to four uh, interchange. Uh. How often that you your MRT you can get MRT line that connected to four interchange? Uh. Yeah. Uh, Tony, I think your last point is the greatest point of all because connectivity is king. That's what I feel. Yeah. So we have already three good points. So what are the three not so good points? Well, um, personally, I think number one will be the price point. Uh, it, it's expected to be launched at 2,000 per square feet uh, and above. Mm, I think that we do have to accept the price point because going down forward, uh, the new normalcy is going to be at this kind of prices. Um, second will be the south facing units of the development is facing Bishan Park and for what we know that from the URA master plan, there's a plot of land that is designated for residential use. So this one take note, the gross plot ratio is 4, 4.2, I uh, need to double check on it. So at this type, there will be pockets of view of Bishan Park that might be blocked. No, I'll take care of it. And how about you, Tony? The last point, what do you think? I think for MO resident, because there's are only 372 units available. So it's, uh, even though if you want to buy, you need to play hard on it because it's, uh, everyone is just mm. so love this about this uh, project. So please place your booking with us and I will, we will share more with you. And we also will play together with you to get a unit. Alright, uh, we have come to the end of this video. Uh, we hope that this video has provided some information for you in a macro view. So if you like this video, please like, subscribe and share. So thank you very much for joining us at Boat. Bye.